Hello guys, I am Shravya. Welcome to our channel, Edu UDR. As a part of regression analysis, today let us see how to implement simple linear regression. Simple linear regression. What is simple linear regression? It is a statistical method that allows us to summarize and study the relationship between two continuous variables. And those two, two variables can be called as predictor and a response variable. In general, predictor is also known as independent variable and responsible, response variable is also known as dependent variable because this response variable will be depending on independent variable to find the best fit line. It is simple linear regression. Why it is called simple linear regression? It is called simple linear regression because it concerns with the study of only one predictor variable. And when it comes to multilinear regression, we will be studying about two or more predictor variables. So it is called multilinear regression. And now let us implement our project salary prediction using simple linear regression in Python. This is all about predicting the salary of employees depending on their years of experience. Now let us see how to implement it. I am using Anaconda to implement this project and I have created my workspace in Jupyter Notebook. I have, this is the data set to predict the salaries and it comprises of years experience and salary. It has two variables years experience and salaries and there are 30 rows and now let us implement it. This is the code to implement our project. First we have to import modules. Import numpy as np, matplotlib.pyplot as pld, import pandas as pd and run this. Yeah, next after that step we have to import the data set. To import the data set, first create I created a variable called data set and using read-csv function I have imported my data set pt.read-csv and name of the data set will help to read the data set and next I have taken two variables x and y to extract the rows of the data set in this way we can extract the rows of the data set and run this yes and third step third step is to split the data set into training set and test set further we have to use a scalar dot model selection module and from that we have to import train dash tests as split function and now i am creating four variables x dash train x underscore test y underscore train y underscore test and using this function i am splitting my data set into test set and training set and run that next step is to fit the function fit all the training set and after fitting training set we have to fit test set what is fitting fitting is like feeding our model means that is we are giving intelligence to our model after data is fit into our model we say our model is trained to fit the model we use we import linear regression from sklearn.linear model library. We use linear regression function and we fit the train. We are now fitting the training set. So we use x underscore train and y underscore train and run this. This is the output we have got. What is our next step? 
to predict the test set results so create y underscore predict and give predict of x underscore test because we have to predict the results which is present in our test set and run this and yeah we have trained our model and the last step is to visualize the results first let us see the results of training set to see the training set results we generally use graphs to visualize our results we use matplotlib function for visualization and we use just we'll draw now scatter plot yeah and run this this is the best fit line that we have obtained for training set now we'll go we'll visualize the test set results yeah this is the line best fit line we have obtained for our test data set and now let us predict the salary for some x number of years let us say now let us predict for 5 years for 5 years we have obtained 73545.90 approximate we'll compare this with our data set for 5.1 we have salary of 66029.00 and what we have obtained 73545 it's close it's almost close yes and this is how we implement we implement the project and further reference code please visit this url don't forget to like share and subscribe thank you